middle of the night. It's cold, wet, rainy. I was already in bed in my drawers under the blankets watching TV, chilling. And my lovely fiance wanna remind me that the baby needs some milk on his last bottle and ain't gonna make it through the night. Needs some milk ASAP. I felt like rolling over and telling her to whip out her titty and squeeze some lechita out for Lil Houston. How you think they did it back in the day? So we are currently at the jewelry store. I'm getting my ring size, just a little too big. So let's get it. Oh my God, they opened the house of pies in the woodlands. OMG. My arms are so sore from yesterday's workout. <laughs> You'll be all right. Oh, MG. This place is nice. We're just popping in. Are y'all seeing this right now? Oh, MG. Ooh la la. Yeah, man. I don't know about that diet. I ain't gonna be able to do it, man. Why are you always so destructive with your food? I'm chopping this bad boy up. I'm gonna need some of this right here. This chicken fried steak. Five point. Oh my god. I'm gonna go melt some pictures. My boy on lock say he wants some pictures of us out here doing some rap shit. So I got some pictures. I was out here in the streets doing what we do, you know what I'm saying? Me and baby. See me out here shining on a man. All right, so y'all heard it yourselves. We're actually at the post office right now. He's sending them pictures and a letter. Free Tomcat, by the way. Um, we're gonna actually head out to get a pedicure together right after this. I am in desperate need of a pedicure. Y'all don't understand, it's been about two months. Okay, two months. The last time I went to the nail shop, I took the baby and it was just me and him. He was awake, so he was, you know, trying to move around and play. And I only had time to get a full set. I actually need to get a full set. As well but I'm just gonna hold off and wait till the weekend for that that way I can go by myself and I can take my time because I don't want nobody to be rushing me men do not be afraid to get a pedicure it's soothing they clean your feet they scrub your feet you know what I'm talking about especially those who work hard okay they will rub your feet down boy go get you a pedicure I'm trying to tell you and whenever we get there I'll go ahead and show y'all a before and after of my toes they're licking a little crusty i'm actually wearing some cute shoes today and as y'all saw we went to get my ring size today and some lady spotted my shoes from like across the store that we were at and she ran in there asking me where i got my shoes so she looked dead at my feet and i was pretty embarrassed okay because my toes are looking crusty so don't judge me it is what it is okay i haven't had time like i said um and even when i do have time it is nobody else's fault but mine because i always just put everything else before me all right so as y'all can see these toes are in need of a pedicure I needed to have massage after that long workout. I hate these chunk clubs. They go to finishing resort. You left there, baby. This is good salad from Salada. That crab meat up in there, baby. Oh, is that crab meat? Hold up. And we're back. I'm gonna scare Dad back. It's good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You hear me regulating over there? <gasps> Scare me, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> ah, cool your beans, bro. They're bubbling out the pot. Turn down the fire, dude. 
My goodness gracious. You ain't gonna scare nobody with your little girly poop. I didn't say poop. <laughs> <laughs> a poop. A poop. Boop. Hold up, baby. You like that? What is this? Apple and bananas? Oh, yeah, I know you like that. Come on, man. Apples and bananas. Why are you laughing at him? Because he's doing like a little choo choo choo. No, not that. That ain't it. This over here. Mmm. Get that out of space. Okay guys, we're back. I actually wrote down a little recipe because I always forget how to make flautas. So first, you're gonna need chicken breast or thighs, whatever you prefer, corn tortillas, cooking oil, salt, and chicken bouillon powder. And then you can add like your little, I mean, your little lettuce, little avocado, little gamma, whatever you prefer on your flautas. Cheese, all that good stuff. Put the chicken in some boiling water in a pot so it can cook. Who watches Naruto? If you, if you, if you watch Naruto, leave a like on this video. And if you like flowers, leave a like also. Please, it will be really appreciated. Actually, um, it's pretty good. But guys, you know, when you shred your chicken, you gotta make sure you shred it with love. You gotta cook with love. My grandpa's like the goat at cooking though. Gotta give props to him. Okay, that's enough shredding for now. Another one. We got, I, I think we prefer to cook with thighs, boneless, no skinless too. I think it's better for flautas, we think. But it's just what y'all prefer. Also, like, subscribe. It should be right down there below. Yeah, right about right there, yeah, yeah. Just click that. And subscribe with post notifications. So I'll be back with y'all when I get some chicken shredded. Got all the chicken shredded. I don't want to let it fall, but it's all shredded. Got my salt, pepper, we got black pepper from Fiesta. It's a nice store. I'm gonna season it real quick. Mix it up. It might look like I put a lot, but I didn't because it just went on the, all on the top, so. All I gotta do is just, let me wash my hands so I can use my hands. Hold on, guys. That's how you season the chicken, as you can see, guys. Well, you're taking a long time. I'm getting hungry right here. Do I just put this on there? No, that goes in the, in the, no, 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 On no. the pan? I put water in the pan? Hold on. No, you gotta roll the tortilla. I thought you knew what you was doing. I do, but like the... Why do you even have this out? This is supposed to go in the water when you boil the chicken. She never put it in. I'm putting all flavor seasoning in. All flavor seasoning? All purpose, all purpose seasoning, guys. As you can see, it's a really good, actually, really good. All purpose seasoning, all purpose seasoning. inside the pan guys hopefully I'm doing this right I don't really know the fruit recipe guys so um take the camera with me I have the chicken putting it right here here we go here we go here we go go, 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 go. okay I just missed the pan I'm missing the pan so bad oh never mind no I'm not put that in there Gosh, I'm supposed to put in the tortillas. Guys, yeah, cut it. Oh, okay, guys, that did not just happen. Listen. What happened was, I forgot. So, where are those tortillas? Uh, let's just yeah, cut this out. We'll cut this out. Let me mix this back up. Pretty sure you just put it in there, like this, like a taco. Right, guys? Right, Gigi? I don't know. You guys can be able to make those. Yeah. Oh my gosh, but you're making me fall, you're making me drop stuff. Let me trust my instincts. Guys, I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. The tortilla's ripping. You probably think that you are better now. Better now. You Put that in there, put that like this, put that in there. Put that right there, put, I'm just kidding. I don't know what I'm doing, guys, I'm so sorry. 
Why is that mom cooking these? Because she doesn't know how to cook them like me. Okay, I already messed up. Okay, it's falling. That's a lot of grease. <laughs> okay, she came for the rescue. So apparently, Mr. Chef Kingston does not know how to make flautas. Okay, listen, I was just going off what I saw you do. So, what you need is chicken thighs, chicken breast, depending on your preference. We use chicken thighs, right? You put that in a pot and you let it boil, and then you pull it out and you shred it. Once you shred it, you obviously have to season the chicken. And I usually use salt and chicken powder just to season the chicken. Then you get to rolling. Um, a quick trick, do not put corn tortillas in the fridge. They tend to get hard. And when I, I do put them in the fridge and they do come out hard, all I do is put them in the microwave, warm them up, make them a little soft. So then we get to rolling them. So as you can see, I have all the tortillas that I'm gonna use. I actually didn't count them. I did heat them up just a little bit. If you try and roll the plata up when the tortilla is hard, it, it'll break. So you grab a good amount of chicken and you spread it out. Not all the way to the edge, but close enough. So look, whenever you lay the plata down, you have to lay this part at the bottom and let that fry and get hard. That's what I figured. That's what I was trying to do, but it was ripping. Like the, the tortilla, the tortilla was ripping. But tell me why I got in trouble because I wasn't over here helping. Kingston came and attacked me, talking about what happened. You, you left me. You left me. No, I said, where you at? I just ripped all the tortillas. You did not say, did you really rip tortillas? Did you throw them away? Yeah, they're right. Why would you do ripping. that? Oh my God. I was trying to- the food, Nino. I was trying to, to fold it and it was just ripping every single time I folded it. Y'all see what we have to deal with? Okay guys, that's enough of that. We'll be back with y'all. And we back. <laughs> These are your dads. Okay, never mind. Thought they were mine. Okay. I'm gonna give him four. Stay on top. Mm, mm, mm. Delicious. And then you sprinkle some of these. Baby, you want avocado? You know I want some avocado. You know I want some avocado. So I'm gonna, you want yellow cheese or you want queso fresco? I want queso fresco. Queso fresco, right? Okay, you just break some of this down. We the best music. DJ Khaled. Alright, and I'm gonna go ahead. Cutting avocado. Alrighty. Yeah, Doing. Okay, so usually I make this with rice, but we don't have rice today. So this is what we're gonna eat today. Yeah. Hold on, let me, let me be the taste tester, man. Let me be the taste tester and let me try this out. See First how time coming in the vlog. See what it's doing, just so man. You can eat. Hey, man, I've been busy. Come on, beans, Jake. Ah. Go get your plate, I'm gonna need a fork. I'm seasoning the chicken. I You're made the beans. You're supposed to eat it with your hand, right? Yep. Yeah. Yes, so I don't know why he uses a fork. You guys. Mmm, um, how's it taste? Is the chicken good? I see you in your right hand. I can sell this. What is up, you too? What it be like, man? We basically just wanted to talk to y'all. Honestly, did not expect this many views. Um, all y'all that have been commenting and just uh, keeping it real with us and letting us know how y'all feel, showing love, like, oh my God. We appreciate y'all. Um, if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button, and also <coughs> go ahead and click on that little bell. That way you can get notifications whenever we are about to upload. Don't give up, keep going, stay motivated, stay disciplined and dedicated, okay? And a lot of y'all oh, y'all be like praising me as like a great father and a good husband and a family man, but I really want to thank you. I'm about to cry. I would not have been able to do what I do without her. Yeah. Because I have four kids, you know what I'm saying? She came into the picture with one daughter. I have four, you know what I'm saying? So, I appreciate you, baby. Why you made me cry on camera? <laughs> Oh my god, babe, that was so sweet. I love you. Fellas out there, man, you need to find you a good woman, man. <sighs> They're not uh, easy to come by, so when you do find one, make sure you treat her right and hold on to her and don't be doing no dumb fuck shit. 
Especially when y'all got kids involved, because you ain't just hurting your partner, you're hurting your child. Whew! That was deep. We've been um, kind of researching and uh, watching a lot of the YouTubers that are out now and they're popular. It's kind of funny to see their vlogs compared to our vlogs because I feel like um, some of them, they like act it out or they prepare it to where, oh, this is what we're going to vlog about. They be faking like turkey bacon, and, man. And honestly, and I'm And we not, ain't doing no faking over here, man. We turn the camera on and press record. I, I'm not I'm not hating or anything because I have watched a lot of these vloggers. Um, but shout out to everybody that kind of inspired us. Put that idea or thought in our heads uh, to want to record and see how it went. So... And before we go, man, I want to give a shout out to Eduardo Hernandez. And I want to give a shout out to Stephanie Manzanares. Hopefully, uh, really? hopefully I said your name right. I'm sorry if I didn't. But thank y'all for tuning in and watching and always showing us love. We, we love y'all. We appreciate y'all, man. Stay down, stay real.